Greetings everybody and welcome to Wager Talk TV. I'm Pavlos Lagoretos here with a free play in the League's Cup on Friday uh, with a match between LAFC and Tijuana. Uh, but before that, I want to remind you guys about my streaks. I'm number one in soccer in the last 30 days with the plus 44 units. I'm on an 8 and 1 run in Asian spread bets and 27 and 13 run in 4% Asian spread bets and on a 7 2 run in 4% Asian totals. Um, last season we made a whopping 79 units in the League's Cup uh, with a 70% win rate, 23 and 10. Uh, and we have a nice code for you guys. You can use coupon code SOC30 to get 30 days of soccer for just 129. That's uh, $50 off. As we have three. 4% uh, League's, uh, League's Cup best bets for the weekend. So head over to my page at wt.buzz.pl where you'll find my free plays and all my promos. Now onward to our free play, uh, LAFC versus Tijuana. Uh, League's Cup on Friday, 11 p.m. Eastern kickoff. Uh, we like goals here. LAFC are minus 167 favorites. The draw is at plus 320 and Tijuana are plus 420 underdogs with the Asian spread set at 1 and the Asian total set at 2.75 goals. Now, LAFC, they're in incredible form right now, coming off a nice win against the Seattle Sounders, 3-0 in Seattle. Uh, they won 13 of the last 16 matches, and the only blip in the radar was uh, a 5-1 loss to Columbus at home, but Columbus were in hellish form back then, and uh, you need to take that result with a grain of salt, uh, because Columbus are you know one of the best teams in the MLS. Now, LAFC, they have the best home record in the MLS with nine wins, three draws, and one loss. They scored 31 goals and conceded 14 in the process. Now, what about Tijuana? They're, uh, they were really bad in the clausura of the Liga MX that finished uh, back in May. They finished second to last with just two wins in 17 matches and just one win in nine away matches with uh, one win, three draws, and five losses. And they were even worse on the road in the previous edition of the Liga MX Apertura, uh, with zero wins, one draw, and seven losses in eight away matches. They scored just three goals and conceded 15. Uh, but they shook things up in the offseason. They made a lot of changes. They got a new coach and some new players, including former Minnesota United uh, forward Emmanuel Reynoso, uh, who had 27 goals and 41 assists in 100 matches uh, in his four seasons with Minnesota. And he was actually instrumental in Minnesota's run to the quarterfinals of the League's Cup last season. Uh, he had two goals and three assists in five matches. So uh, he's playing for Tijuana now and he's back to his hunting grounds. So we might see some goals here. Now, Tijuana, they had a decent start in the Liga MX Apertura that started in early July. They have two wins, one draw and one loss. Uh, they're 3-1 and one to the over 2.5 goals and they're on an 8-3 and three run to the over 2.5 goals dating back to last season. Again, the Asian spread on this match is set at 2.75 goals, which is uh, a split line between two and a half goals and three goals, and we like the over. So uh, LAFC, they have the quality to score three on their own and cast this ticket uh, alone by themselves, although they've lost some of their defensive prowess as of late. Uh, they have just two clean seats in the last nine matches, so I wouldn't be surprised if Tijuana assisted in the scoring here. So um, take the over 2.75 goals at minus 120. I think this is going to be a goal fest. So make sure to like and subscribe to our channel. Uh, drop a comment below with uh, your picks or your thoughts about uh, my play and uh, good luck with your bets.